now to the latest on protecting swimmers from shark attacks. Governor Hochul announced the deployment of 60 drones to patrol state beaches this summer. Yeah, as of July 17th, there have been 25 shark attacks in the United States this year, including five who were attacked in New York over the 4th of July holiday weekend. And a live look right now from the O-Search website that tracks sharks across the globe. You can see that there are great white sharks right now just to our north. You can also track the history of sharks movements in our area. Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles has the story. I felt like something grabbed me by my thigh and I, I screamed to my friends. I said something is biting me. Ludmila Imog was swimming off the beaches of Fire Island on the 4th of July when a shark latched onto her thigh and groin. The 47-year-old was able to free herself by reaching into its mouth and found the strength to open it up wide enough to release the shark's grip. Like I had to really, you know, yeah, struggle to, you know, unclench the jaw. I saw the, the blood, but I was still walking and uh, I knew I'm going to be fine. When I saw her in, on the stretcher, she was super calm, right? Like, this is not what you expect from shark bites or bites in general. People are in a lot of pain. She didn't ask for pain medication. She was, she, I think her adrenaline was still probably pretty high after this. This shark biting is one of five incidents that happened during a two-day time span over the holiday weekend. Now, Suffolk County lifeguards are using drones to watch out for sharks in real time. It took me underwater and I kicked it once and it let go. And I swam to the top and I just screamed. I was like, Reese, it bit me, it bit me, it bit me. Help, help, help. Just last Friday in New Smyrna Beach, Florida, 21 year old Chris Pospisil is yanked off his surfboard by a shark. I thought my foot might be gone when it, when it first attacked me. The first thing that went through my mind was, this can't be real. This is as real as it gets, as sharks have been swimming closer to shore this year. Experts believe in pursuit of schools of fish.